So I've just been to the O2 shop to get myself a Dell Streak. For those that aren't aware, it's um, a 5 inch, it's almost a cross between a phone and a tablet. It does do voice calls if you get the correct SIM. Um, got a beautiful 5 inch screen, 800 by 480 resolution. Um, so we're going to take a look within the box. The guy at the shop did open it to show me that everything was in there. Got our manual, put my SIM card ready to go. I got the um, basically it's like a data modem, so I can't actually make voice calls on this, but I get uh, a gig of data and unlimited Wi Fi through like BT Open Zone hotspots and such. Um, you can pay 15 a month for 3 gig and unlimited Wi Fi, um, and you can change it month to month. So if you know you're going to use a lot of data one month, you can, you can bounce up. I'm also told you can ring and ask to get an unlock, you know, tell them you're going abroad or something and then 14 days hopefully you get an unlock code but at the same time I've been told, um, some, they have told some people that they won't be unlocking them for 12 months. So we've got the actual device, look at that, it's very slim looking. The back cover with the, the Dow logo, the battery itself. Have a look. 15 30 milliamp hours. So let's slide the, slide the device out because we can have it booting up while we look at the other bits and pieces. In we won't put the SIM in just here, I suppose. Right. Here goes the battery. It was pretty sturdy. Is there any tips for which way? I think it goes like that. Slide. There we go. Slide locks into place. That's very nice. So a five megapixel camera with dual LED flash there as well. Um, the right way up. Feels uh, kind of quite a sturdy. Quite a sturdy bit of kit, it doesn't feel flimsy by any means. Is that enough to boot it up? Okay, in the meantime, that's the down there we go. We get a kind of a, a cloth a cloth bag for it to go in. My warranty. Inside we get um, another box. Slide down for a second, we can still see that bit in the corner. So in the box itself, got the charger which has two different uh, slot in options. One if you're going abroad and one for the UK. Still booting it behind style. Um, the headset here, which looks very similar to you know most headsets as you would expect, and then the actual data cable. Um, you see the connector there; it's quite a large connector, USB. There we go. Get the protective scar straight off. It's uh, supposed to have, I think they call it Gorilla Glass. I'm not too worried about what that's going to protect Gorilla Glass from. We're still booting. It does look a very nice screen already, I can see. It has the um, 1 gigahertz, I think it's the Snapdragon processor. Um, it has, I think, it's two gig space for apps it's themselves. I believe it has 512 meg of RAM on board RAM, and this particular one comes with a 16. It's already in there, a 16 gig uh, micro SD card. So this one was 399 for 449. You can get the 32 gig version. It's making noises. There we go. No SIM card. Screen locked. Press menu to unlock. Where's where is menu? 
oh, menu menus on the side. So this is what we this is what we start with. Picture of the Millennium Dome. Got my power bar down in the bottom corner. I can see already. Welcome to Dell Streak. Press home to exit. So it's showing me all the different uh, what the different bits of the menu do. Got a volume rocker at the top. Don't know if you can see that's not. Uh, too clear. Power on off the camera, the camera button. Oh, that's quite a nice camera button, yeah, good. Um, also, you've got back menu and home over on the sides and the charge connector underneath. Tap the out of view all the applications. Drag an application to the home screen for quick access, so that's fairly normal. Um, tap the title in the home and the browser to set additional views. Tap the notification notification area to view messages and alerts. Yeah, fairly normal. Tap the status to connect to Wi-Fi, view power saving tips, or turn on aeroplane mode. Tap back. Right, we know how the back works. We've got a menu button. We've got a home button. Sorry, I'm going a bit off camera there. Getting carried away. Lastly, on any home screen, you can swipe side to side, press and hold on the background to add content or change the wallpaper. Press hold on item. To join. Yeah, so it's all uh, it's all fairly you know, regular stuff. Turn the point up just for now. Um, I had a quick play in the shop before I got in. It it does feel very smooth. Now the only sort of um, downside that I'm concerned by at this point is that it's only on 1.6 Android 1.6, but. I don't know, it seems smooth, it's got a fast process, it's got a gorgeous looking screen. So uh, we'll see how I get on. I will obviously I will report back when I've been playing with it for a day or two. But there it is, the Dell Streak uh, on O2. Locked to O2, unfortunately, but we'll see if we can uh, we'll see if we can get around that. For more information, more news, app reviews, hemadroids.net.